Today, the color paint you see is all green. Masterworks IO was able to flip that painting for a 32% return on investment, doubling the S&P in the same time period. Wow, here to sketch out how it all went down and to unveil some of his most recent investment art opportunities is founder of masterworks.io, Scott Lynn here in a Fox Business exclusive. First of all, congratulations, That that's unbelievable. So. Tell me how the sale went down, and can you say who you sell, sold it to, and then what you heard from investors who, in some cases, really only bought 1,000-piece tranches, $1,000 piece moves? I mean, I think it was a great proof of concept for Masterworks for the asset class. Um, obviously, a 32% annualized return is, is super hard to beat, um, particularly when there was a lot of, of questions just around COVID and how would COVID impact the art market. Um, so I think this this really demonstrates the resilience of the art market overall during otherwise volatile times. So that piece itself, and then we've seen some other ones. What you have able to be, have been able to do is offer a to investors out there. You know, look, maybe people feel that they're too heavy in equities, so they say, let me get a few different types of investments, right? Alternative investments, and. This has turned out, at least in this case, to look really good. Let's talk about another one that you put up for investment in. Is it still $1,000 per piece tranches? It, you know, it really depends. We, we structure our minimums around each investor, but sure, we, we have investors investing $1,000. We have investors investing $25,000 a painting, uh, depending on the person. And so the Jean-Michel Basquiat. Now, this is a very hot artist. He is no longer alive, sadly, but his work sell for millions and millions of dollars. What did you buy it for? Yeah, so that particular painting, if I, if I recall correctly, we purchased for roughly uh, $5 million. Uh, it sold out very quickly. And you're right, I mean, Basquiat's market's one of the most interesting that we track. So historically, he's appreciated 17, 18% a year for 20, 30 years uh, with a relatively low degree of volatility. So we think he's one of the most investable artists in the in the contemporary art market today. I can hear some of our viewers saying, wait, that that just looks like scratches, but you got to know Basquiat. <laughs> <laughs> there's, there's, he's not, there's always he's not four you know, years that, old. Okay. Yeah. Could my, you know, could my kid paint this? Uh, we hear it all the time, but, uh, but yeah, those, those paintings do sell for, for millions of dollars. Let's talk about the secondary market because you haven't sold this yet. So if people want to get their money out in some way, shape or form, how does that work? Can they sell their share before you sell the piece of work? Yeah, so I think, um, you know, just over a year ago when, when I was on the show, we were talking about securitizing paintings and that, that was the first time ever that, that a painting had been securitized. Today, fast forwarding a, a year later, we're now uh, having investors trade shares in paintings through our, through our trading platform. So very similar to how you trade shares in individual companies, you can come to masterworks.io and trade shares in, in individual paintings. So they can take these, say they want it, they can then go to the secondary market, right? And and can you give us an example of the returns on that? You know, the, the returns on the secondary market have been have been pretty impressive. I think, and I'll, I'll get this number specifically wrong, but, but in aggregate, if you look at all returns from investors investing in primaries and then selling in the secondary market, they've been above 15% um, annualized a year. So I think it's, okay. it's definitely, we're seeing a ton of activity there. Um, and it's really interesting to watch how people are valuing paintings, trading shares and paintings, um, just like they do stocks. Got it. Well, uh, Scott, we're watching it. When you sell the Basquiat, come back. We'd love to see the return on that one. And uh, the company's called masterworks.io, securitizing painting. No, you don't get to put it on your, your, your walls, okay, guys? You just own a piece of it like a stock certificate. All right, thanks so much. Good luck to you, Scott. Thank you so much.